Hey students, I am going to discuss the problem of larger thermodynamics. The problem is an ideal gas has molar heat capacity Cb at constant volume. Find molar heat capacity of the gas as a function of volume V. If the gas undergoes a process, T is equal to T naught e to power alpha V. Okay. Now here you are given the process T is equal to T naught e to power alpha V using first law thermodynamics. Using first law thermodynamics. We have U is equal to delta E plus W. For one mole of the gas, we can write C delta. T is equal to C V delta T plus P delta V. Okay, or C is equal to C V plus P delta V over delta T. In terms of differentiation, this can be written as dV over dt. So we can write C is equal to C V plus P dV over dt. Okay. My first change is P by using P V is equal to N R T. So using P V is equal to N R T. We have here N is equal to one. So this P V is equal to R T only. N is equal to one. So this is P is equal to R T upon V. So for this value in this equation, we have. C is equal to C V plus R T upon V to D V over D T. Okay. Now we have to find the value of D V over D T from the equation as you have given. T is equal to three naught D V over R T. So T is equal to three naught D V over R T. So D V over sorry D T over D V is equal to Not the power of R B. Differentiate with respect to V, so it will be T not e to the power of R B times alpha. Okay. Now uh, here this quantity again, this T, so we can write here as alpha T. Okay. Now so put this value of D V over D T here, or you first change it to D V over D T. This becomes one upon alpha T. So. C is equal to C V plus here it is R T upon B and D V over D T is one upon alpha T. So T will cancel out. So it will be C V plus R upon alpha B. Okay.